Hi Aquarius, it's L here to do your May 2018 mid monthly reading. Thank you to all of my subscribers. Um, thank you for the likes, the shares, the comments, um, the subscriptions, all of it. It's much appreciated. It's it's a beautiful thing. Um, I brought back the fifteen dollar special reading. It's up to three questions. Make them simple questions. If there's an eight part question, I will not honor the question. I will not honor the reading. I will refund you your money. Let's not rape my energy. Come on, guys. Let's be fair. I brought it back. So let's just be fair. All right. But anyhow, um, I have shuffled and prayed over the cards off camera, but we give the cards a quick shuffle and we get started. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the messages for Aquarius. True, accurate messages of love and light. Needed advice for Aquarius and love, career, money, home. All right, so it's going to do a five card spread for you guys. Uh, the first card is where you are. Where you are. Where is Aquarius? Aquarius right where they are. It's right where they are. Okay. Um, the second card is are you on your correct path? Okay. Um, and the third card is the main obstacle. Okay. The fourth card is what is helping you. The fifth card is how can progress be made? How can progress be made for Aquarius? Bottom of the deck, the Five of Wands. Right. Talks about inner conflict, outer conflict, the petty arguing, competition. Right where you are, wow, stable, worried about your foundation or concerned about, or right where you are, building. Building that, that solid foundation with the Ten of Pentacles here. Solid money, family life, home, mental, emotional. Just a beautiful thing that's right where you are. Um, are you on your correct path? Oh, the death card. Yeah, complete transformation around all of those things I just mentioned. All right. Oh, or a change. Or something's ending and something else is beginning for Aquarius. What is the main obstacle? you needing to make a decision I just heard are you in or are you out you feel like you don't have all the information all the money all the time all the whatever and you're trying to protect your heart it's a head over heart decision but you know your, your heart and your mind have to be aligned to make this decision some of you are confused and have inner conflict about the situation pray for clarity play pray for um yeah clarity and to make final decisions what is helping you the knight of cups could be a cancer pisces scorpio not in particular sometimes this is aquarius when aquarius is Feeling the love is in love is wanting to. Um, this is also a, a, a very creative Aquarius, creative in the arts, in the esoteric, hidden knowledge. This is this is Aquarius on some some path, some some emotional. Have emotional journey. Could be dealing with the Pisces, with the fish, the like fish on his cloak. Oh, okay, how can progress be made? Uh, probably need to come out of the Nine of Swords energy. Uh, go ahead and let it go to the Ten of Swords. That'd be the final ending there. Um. Come out of anxiety and stress. Some of you need to be concerned about your health. 
you need to institute a new exercise program some self-care here some of you need to get some rest the creative juices are blocked all right judgment sits on the ten of pentacle all right so spirit is reviving something or trying to revive something so that you can make a final decision around it and we've got the death card here so it's like you need to make a final decision around uh, maybe what you already have established some of you are married, partnered, and long-term partnerships. Yeah, two of pentacles. You're trying to weigh up two of swords, two of pentacles. You're trying to weigh up two very real options. Okay, some of you need to make a decision about a cancer person. Or you just need to make a decision. Are you moving forward alone? You need to get in control and not be so easily swayed left and right oh wow knight of pentacles on the knight of cups i think you have two very solid offers or yeah you don't know oh yeah you don't know which one to choose aquarius this is what's coming up for you for the rest of may Page of Swords. How can progress be made? You got to cut something out. You also have to do your research. Six of Cups. Some of you are dealing with... Someone younger than you. Some of you are dealing with wayward children. Like, they're really stressing you out. You're being short with them. They might be being short with you. <sighs> okay. What is... What is the Knight of Cups? The Knight of Pentacles? Some of you have two very solid, yeah, somebody's sneaking away. Five of Cups, yeah. So, Aquarius. Typically, my Aquarius, okay, so I'm going to talk to the Aquarius man. The Aquarius man has two women or two whatever two two people that they're dealing with one you're in a long-term committed relationship you could even be married but you're weighing up the decision to walk away from this marriage and and go it alone maybe to even accept an offer from someone else or to start something anew with someone else aquarius woman you have two solid offers. You don't see it. You don't see it. Or you're you're so bogged down with what you got going on with yourself. Um or you've been through so much crap that you don't see that you have two solid offers here. Or that someone really, really, really likes you. What is the Two of Swords and the Chariot? Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, some of you are really deciding to just work on you. Go it alone. You feel like you put work into a situation that has yielded no benefit. No real significant benefit for you. Queen of Pentacles. Yeah. Some of you could be partnered to, married to a Capricorn Virgo Taurus. What's the five of wands? What is the five of wands? Who's the five? Of wands? Three of wands. Yeah. Okay. And then the fool at the bottom of the deck. Some of you 
it's really you really have is in some of you okay so it's a move it's a physical move for some some of you you have to um think about where you're moving to are you really going to move um and then for some of you it's an actual move away from a, a relationship um a business you have to weigh up you know the pros and cons in relationship and business are you going to leave the partnership behind whether that's relationship or business what are you doing let's see what the additional support butterfly oracle advice cards have to say family changes this fell out off deck for you i mean off camera for you oh um, this talks about someone moving in and out of the home of uh, someone getting married, someone getting an addition to the home, renovations to a home, a new home, uh, adoption, adoption of a pet. You know, it's family changes, divorce, separation. And for some of you, you know, you're really contemplating that because uh, it's, it isn't getting any better. Courage, yes, you have to have the courage to move forward on whatever it is you 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 need to move forward on. Whether that's making a decision about which partner you want to be with, Aquarius, or it's um, making a decision about um, where you're moving, sticking out of the deck, relationship dynamics. Someone has entered or exited a relationship changing the dynamics of an established relationship i think the book says something like that um i always and then retirement at the bottom of the deck okay i'll talk about this in a second um this is exactly what it is this is a complete relationship read some for, from, for some of you is business too like you gotta weigh up do you keep putting time and energy into this job or um or to this business what do you do there needs to be complete transformation with the death card here all right so relationship dynamics something has changed within the relationship you went outside of the relationship the other person went outside of the relationship something has changed you're more aware of how you feel the dynamics of your relationship have changed will change there'll be actual physical family changes here ten of pentacles here um, then we have retirement. Retirement not only talks about, of course, retirement from work or what you do for income, but this card also talks about self-employment. It talks about the reduction in hours that you put into work. Um, so you're, you're you might be going to part time um, because you can do that. It's time for you to do that. You need to be more concerned about yourself and your health so you are reducing uh, a number of hours you're putting into a situation you're also concerned about savings and retirement with the ten of pentacles here you're worried about the long term the long run your legacy what do you leave behind for the next generation um it's so many things here also some of you oh I just <laughs> not funny some of you are concerned about your retirement in the midst of getting a divorce. You don't want the spouse to touch your retirement. You don't want them to have to touch your 401k and all other kind of investments. Like, I get it. I get it, you know. Yeah. And it's not funny. It's not It's not funny, but um, so very specific. Anyhow, um, some of you are hesitating before making this decision and you're just sneaking around and sneaking about and trying to devise a plan of action, which, um, or and or someone is, is being sneaky around you and trying to devise a plan of action to do away with something else that they're established in to possibly come and offer you something. I don't know if you'll accept it when they come. Aquarius, let me know. Uh, please get in the comments. Comment, comment, comment. Like, like, like. Uh, request a personal reading. Go over to the website. All, 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 A L L information is below in the description box. Um, 
from my email to my website to the GoFundMe to my Instagram handles to the Instago handle. I mean, everything is below. Um, get in touch with me. Uh, let me know how this resonated for you. Aquarius, I am praying for you guys. As you know, I'm an Aquarius sun. Um, pray for me as well. It looks good for us. So we just got to make some decisions about what we're going to do, how we're going to do it, who we're going to do it with. Um, a lot of you have manifested some really good changes in your life. Uh, just go through the change. Sometimes going through the change is the hardest part. Um, but you've manifested this. So um, it'll all turn out well. I'll see you in June, Aquarius. Take care.